And here's the star of the show, the uh, Debo caught monkfish. This was just brought in this morning on a, a day charter boat that's out in Hampton Beach, New Hampshire. This fish is a little bit larger. This is a fish that we'd normally serve at the restaurant. If you're looking for yourself in your home, uh, you probably want to go about three to five pounds is what you want to ask your fish, your fish uh, butcher to do for you. When you're looking at the, at the monkfish, what you want to see is a nice translucent skin, not opaque, and you want to see a good amount of uh, flexibility in it that it's nice and fresh. This monkfish is actually probably the easiest fish to fillet in the world. Just want to start with the skin. You can actually just do this with your hand. It just comes right off. Just peel it right down. Once you get towards the bottom, we're going to be cutting off the very bottom of the tail anyway. So we're going to just leave the skin on right there. It has cartilage, so you just want to cut right in between it. And then with a sharp knife, you want to just start. There's a center bone that runs from the top to the bottom. There's two tails on each side. So you just want to start from one side. Work your way right down the bone. And this is really a great way to have the absolute freshest quality of fish that you could possibly have. And to ensure it, you're buying the fish whole. So now once I've got the first loin off, I'm just gonna take the second loin off. Just by using your fingers as a guide, it's a, a nice way to make an even line right across the tail. And as you can see, there's basically no waste. And to have absolutely no waste, what you want to do would be to just use this frame to make a very simple stock, which you can make a little bit of fish soup, fish chowder. And there you have it. Just going to set the frame and this one tail aside. Now, once you have the lat this tail that you're going to use, just want to take with your knife, very gently come underneath the skin and then back. Just removing any of the silver skin that connects the, the monkfish tail to the actual skin. You've removed that. You want to start from the head of the monkfish. Just slice right down. You're going to make medallions. I usually cut them about four to five ounces per person. I think that that's plenty. If you have people that are larger eaters, you can cut them to a larger portion size. This was a 10 pound fish, and I could easily get six out of this. And if you see a fish that's a little bit larger, that's not in the three to five pound range, you would just ask your fishmonger, I'm sure he would be happy to break the, the monkfish down or whatever fish that you'd like into whatever size would be manageable for you. And I think that's really the best way to purchase your fish is to make sure it has a head on it, make sure that you can look into its eyes and they're clear and not cloudy, and the uh, meat has a nice uh, white, uh, white appearance. Thank you.